I just found out last night that there's a, a gentleman sitting down here in the middle row who spent 27 years in the Air Force. And he actually admits it in public. I, I just couldn't believe that. <laughs> Anyhow, uh, I, I, I was talking to Frank earlier and he said, uh, I said, when did you join? He said, 1950. I said, when were you born? I said, 1950. <laughs> But anyhow, he was in at the same time I was later on. I, I joined at 17, so he was in for the, the integration and the, the changing of the, the uniforms from blue and navy to and khaki that I was in and to the green. So this little ditty is for Frank. Because the Air Force, as you know, they don't, they don't really, I mean, they get paid, but I mean, they really don't. Anyhow, it's called the Integration Song, and, and it, it's about when they changed us all back in the late 60s to, to a green uniform. And uh, it was written by a, a, a fellow in Germany that I served with at the time. He came from the Navy after 20 years of cooking on a ship to the Army, and the first thing we did was went out into the field for 12 weeks. So that was his introduction. I was on the Sea Court, ladies and gentlemen. I was on the Bonaventure when the news came through. We used to have an army, we had an navy too. We had a little air force somewhere up there in the blue. But now they gone and changed it all. What am I to do? I got some green turkey gators and beige and grease. An unloaded pistol and a magazine. My hair is cut, my shoes are shined, there's not so for long, and they're gonna put me in a green uniform. I pray, if you can read the English, it's wrote the other way. Two props are painted on the side to show just how we feel. That this is a decoration that can't be for real. I got some green turkey gators and beige grease. An unloaded pistol and a magazine. My hair's cut, my shoes are shined, there's not so far long. And they're gonna put me in a green. And they did. They put us in a green uniform. There you go.